going to be a busy morning I'm queuing back here <laughs> well good morning YouTube I'd like to welcome you to this beautiful grey morning in the county of Surrey in the United Kingdom this is classic UK. The, the only thing we're missing is a, a little bit of light drizzle. Grey and light drizzle. I guess that's why we need a good sense of humour because we'd all bloody top ourselves otherwise. And if it's not raining, how is my visor wet? That really draws my shit. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Seriously, where's this come from? It's not f***ing raining. Look at this twat on his phone. Got absolutely no idea I'm here. Come on. I should say that I do say thank you quite a lot to cars that move out of the way. I know a lot of bikers give it the old cheese mate. I do the uh, foot out of the side, particularly if, if it's on the right hand side. Uh, where's that come from again? It's not raining. Maybe it is raining. I think it might be actually. I witnessed a rear ending yesterday at that junction. I don't mean some lurid dogging activity. Um, well, I'll show you, I'll put a little clip in here. I just put that clip in and I stopped talking to wait for you to watch that clip. Such an idiot. No. Nice, well spotted. Go on, f*** him. Watch your sprocket. Don't do that! Don't understand that, he was like halfway across the junction and then decided to let him out. I'm almost doing an emergency stop. Stay behind you, don't worry. Somebody actually made a good point in, in the comments. Was it the last video? I think it might. It was the last one, wasn't it, where I spoke about the general want to get ahead of a scooter. Anyway, um, he made a good point in that scooters are, tend to be more nimble around town. You can... fucking brilliant. Yeah, he said because scooters tend to be a little bit more nimble, you can chuck them in and out of traffic, but when the traffic thins out, the bikes are obviously quicker. So they catch up, and that's the kind of situation where you think a bike is trying to get ahead of you all the time, when really, he's just quicker. So that's fair enough, and that's actually very true. Oh, shall I risk it? for a biscuit. Shouldn't have risked it. <laughs> many Rosas here today. I haven't had any police here for a while actually. Don't do it. Talking of police, I got bloody pulled yesterday for speeding. I was on the A3 coming back the other way. I play football up in Sheen so I have to catch the A3 back down. I was in the car and uh, there's a bit that goes from 40 to 50 and I just give it some beans to overtake overtake a couple of people and kind of didn't slow down went round a corner and he was there with his gun I knew I'd be done straight away I kind of I even like stuck my hand up and apologised as I was going past like oh no and then they didn't pull out at first and I thought maybe they're just sort of monitoring and whatever and then I thought well no they blatantly caught me they're just gonna um, you know I'm gonna get something in the post but then I think I'm not sure if you get done with a speed gun. I, I, I think, I don't know if they can um, They can do it by pace. They've got to come and issue you a ticket because they're not actually taking a picture. They're just doing it with a speed gun. Anyway, they did come and get me. About 10 seconds later, they were up my uh, passage. And then when a convenient place came to stop, they gave me the blue lights, but I just got a ticket off. They were really good, actually, really, really good. I explained that, you know, if I'd have been going about three miles an hour more, I'd have been on a speed awareness course. But the cop knew my... I, he went in and checked all my details, gave him a licence, and he went, you smoky? And I thought, oh, God. Oh, my God, this guy watches the videos. And I was like, yeah, how do you know that? And apparently it's a nickname that was on record, so I've obviously been known to the police, shall we say, and at some point, I don't know, I, it was bizarre much like that bike. 